Hey guys, today I'm going to be reviewing Too Faced's La Creme Lipstick in Naked Dolly. Uh, I have it on my lips, um, so you can see what it looks like there. And this is what I, it looks like on my hand. I hope you guys can see that. Um, I would give this a 3 out of 5 because... Um, okay, the good points about it are that it's very moisturising. I think it would be a really, really good lipstick for the winter months because it feels like you have a lip balm on your lips. Um, I love the colour. Uh, I chose it because it's a nude light, uh, a light pink nude. Very light pink nude. Um, and I like that they have a big range of colours to choose from, so you don't you know they have their nude collection, they have their pink collection, and they have their red collection and there's just so many colours to pick from you know for every occasion. I really like the packaging as well, it's very simple and gold and you know just not fussy at all um, and it looks very elegant and classy I think. <laughs> and it does feel really really good on your lips. The reason why I gave it 3 out of 5 as opposed to 5 out of 5 is because um, firstly it's quite an expensive lipstick and I do not think it is worth the £18 sadly um, just because well to be fair I when I was looking around online people did say that the Naked Dolly colour was the problem they said that all the other colours worked really well but the problem with Naked Dolly is you put it on and it looks like you have pat uh, your lips <laughs> your lips are very streaky and patchy and it just doesn't look it looks like you just don't know how to put lipstick on which probably is true in my case but you know for people that do know how to put lipstick on it looks like they've done a rubbish rubbish job which obviously you don't want. So in order to try and correct that problem you have to put a lot of coats on even then I don't think it really helps that much but putting on a lot of coats on means using more of the product and therefore using more money which you know no one wants to spend a lot of money. I to say it does smell quite nice but then the smell goes. Another, <laughs> that's a good point, a thing about it is you put it on and it doesn't last very long and when it does go, you know, when the moisture do does go and the colour starts to go, you're left with a very, uh, very dry lips and the colour kind of, um, it feels like it's flaking off, which it just looks horrible. So yeah, I just, I think I would need to try another colour because as people said, um, the other, the other colours don't seem to have the problem that Naked Dolly does, which is, you know, it's a shame that Naked Dolly turned out that way because I do really like the colour. I think it's a very, uh, it's a colour that goes with so many looks, so it would be so great to use, but c'est la vie. I would give it three out of five. But I think I will buy another colour just so I can maybe do this review again and just, be like stay away from Naked Dolly or stay away from all of the La Creme lipsticks. I hope you enjoyed my review and I hope you find it helpful. If you did please like and subscribe. Thank you so so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye!